Welcome, welcome once again to Cooking Around's channel. Welcome, welcome. What do we have for you today? Another diet plan, a seven day diet plan. And it's all new. And it's part of the Magic Diet series. Just take a look at this. Because of the success of the other programs I designed, I created something new. Uh, completely different taste, more filling, more nutritious. And if you look on the side here, you will see that I have protein and carbohydrates. So now you can add this to the soup and make it your way. Okay, here we go. Grab yourself a medium pot or a large pot and add about one tablespoon of olive oil. Add one medium diced onion. Now here I'm using the white onion because it's sweeter. But you know you can use regular type onions or you can even use red onions. Now let's add two to three cloves of minced garlic. And once again, if you're on the brave side, you can add a lot more. Now let's increase the heat a little bit to medium high. And we are now going to add two tablespoons of tomato paste. And this will make the soup very rich. Now here you can add two chopped tomatoes, but make sure they're skinless. But here I'm adding one can of chopped tomatoes. Now let's rinse the can, fill it up full of water, which will be one can measurement, and put that into your soup, and let's mix it. Let's add now about two to three bay leaves, and of course it depends on the size of them. Add one teaspoon of thyme, one teaspoon of basil, one teaspoon of paprika. And to increase your metabolism, half a teaspoon of chili powder. And for that extra boost, hot pepper flakes. And let's not forget the pepper. Add as much as you want, just to make it your way. Add one cube of low sodium veggie stock, or you can add chicken or beef if you want. So let's stir this up. Okay, are we still going? Let's add here half a cup of diced carrots. Let's add about half a cup of green beans. And here I'm adding one whole bell pepper. Now I'm using red, but you can use any color you want. Now here comes the magic. Two cups of shredded cabbage. And I slice this all by hand. And you know, this is the magic. This is that what works into your system and makes you lose the weight and the fat. Now I'm adding about four cups of water, but that depends on how do you want the soup. Do you want it thicker or do you want it thinner? So it's better to add a little bit less water and then add more later. Now bring it to a boil, bring it down to a simmer, make sure it's covered and let it go for about 20 to 25 minutes. Okay, it's been about 25 minutes. Now if you are sensitive to vegetables, leave it going for another 10 minutes. And now look at this soup. It is absolutely awesome. But are we finished? No. Now we're going to add one cup of broccoli florets. And to bring out that taste and to fill you up, we're going to add one cup of zucchini. Now you can slice it or you can cube it. Now let's cover it again, bring it down to a simmer after it boils, and let it go for another 10 to 15 minutes. Now the soup is done. Just look at this. This is really, really something. But I've designed this program that you can now add something to it, but I will ask you to follow the directions in the description below the video so you can follow the program and get the right nutrition in during the week. One part, you will be adding breast of a chicken or turkey pieces to the soup in order to increase your protein intake. Around the middle of the week, we can add brown rice or wild rice. And what this will do, this will give you some carbs in order to increase your energy level. 
and you can also add some beef now you can ha have beef and have it sliced but here I had it minced because it digests better into your system so you let me show you how to make those other three ingredients okay here I have about two pounds of lean beef I'm adding salt but just a little bit for flavoring and I'm adding pepper here you can add as much as you want now let's add one teaspoon of onion powder and let's add one teaspoon of garlic powder and this is going to put some flavoring into the meat so let's mix this all up grab yourself a fry pan add just a little bit of olive oil and let's move that oil all around so we can get it even now take your beef mixture and just drop it right in and flatten it as much as you can just pretend you're making one big hamburger okay now being on medium uh, high I want you to keep on cooking this until it releases most of the fat and then I want you to remove it and I want you to put it into a strainer and let all that fat or most of the fat drain out now here I have about two pounds of turkey breast which I have sliced and flattened and now I just want you to cut it in cubes large cubes or small cubes or shredded that's basically up to you what you want to do and this is basically what we want now here I'm adding more pepper but I'm not adding salt this time let's get it in the fry pan at medium high and let's get this thing going so I'll move it around and because basically we don't have too much oil here so we have to keep it moving so it doesn't burn and keep on moving around flipping around now you don't have to cook this to the point that it is brown a light white will do because this will go into the soup and the flavor will absorb into the turkey or into the chicken breast and here you have it the soup and the three side items to add during the week please once again go into my description and follow exactly the plan how much you're going to put in the soup that depends on you but I want you to eat a lot more soup so once again it's goodbye from Tony and cooking around